Today I'm going to show you our new reference checker that allows you to easily check and make sure that your references are reliable. Uh, so that is, have they been retracted, have they been strongly disputed, or, or more generally, how have they been used. So to show uh, how this works, I wanted to uh, focus in on a preprint that would allow you to change uh, these references. And so this preprint uh, coming from Research Square uh, has uh, a reference section, just like all scientific articles, and you can see uh, the list of them here. Uh, have they been disputed? Have they been retracted? Uh, you can't easily tell. And so with Cite, we've made that uh, quite easy to do, and I'll show you how that works. So you can simply download a PDF, uh, or in the case of if you're still writing, uh, you can save your, your Word document as a PDF. Uh, once you have that, you can go back to Cite, and you go over here, uh, select Reference Check, and what you can do is upload your PDF. So here it is. Uh, and, and with this, we are going to extract out uh, the in-text uh, citations as well as the references and then match them against our data. Uh, and so do any of these, these references in this preprint cite something that's retracted? Do they cite something that's strongly disputed? Uh, or again, more generally, uh, how are these references being cited by others? And so as this runs in the background, uh, our, our machine is matching the references, matching the text, uh, and then pulling from our 600 plus million citation statements uh, to check how references have been uh, cited. And so you can see we've successfully pulled out the title, the authors, and in this case, because there is a DOI, the DOI, uh, we've also successfully parsed out the abstract, and what we've detected are 38 different references in this manuscript. Uh, of these 38 references, there are 4,364 citations to them, uh, and then there's two references with an editorial concern, uh, so in this case a retraction. And so what you can see here uh, is that this is how the authors have used uh, the citation or the reference. So we'll say environmental stress induces the accumulation of reactive oxygen species in cells as a host defense mechanism. However, ROS can cause oxidative stress if produced in excess. And so they're referencing number 29 as if it's reliable, which is this, uh, which has actually been retracted. And so if you click this, it'll bring you to the version of record. Uh, and you can see, indeed, this has been retracted. Uh, or you can go back here and you can click the citation numbers to see how has it been cited. So are other people citing this unknowingly um, or has it been strongly disputed? And so here are different papers showing uh, how this has been cited. And so that is a quick and easy way to, to check your references uh, and to make sure that they're reliable if you're an author uh, or if you're an editor or a peer reviewer. It's a quick way to see uh, our manuscripts that you're reviewing uh, are they referencing content that is reliable? Uh, and then how do other uh, articles reference this as well? Um, so I hope you'll try it. And if you have any questions, feel free to email us at hi at site.ai. Thanks.